Welcome to Africa Rice Center. Africa Rice conserves the largest collection of African rice in its gene bank. This is one of the 11 world-class gene banks of CGR. Africa Rice scientists and partners use the genetic diversity to develop popular rice varieties like Nerica and Arica that are naturally adapted to African conditions. Africa rice is also helping farmers fight climate change through low-cost, farmer-friendly solutions. One such solution is Smart Valley. Welcome to the Smart Valley site of uh, Bay. My name is Eliot Dosiovo. I'm a climate change scientist for agriculture at Africa Rice Center. Farmers were suffering a lot from the impact of climate change here. They often sow rice in June, but in July, they often face a long dry spell, while in September, the whole valley was flooded. Before, we were producing rice only once a year, and sometimes when there is drought, when there is flooding, we have very low yields. During the dry season, we were not doing anything, and our income was so low. Since 2018, Africa Rice and the farmers engaged in this very exciting venture of Smart Valley's approach implementation. In short, the Smart Valley approach is a participatory approach for land and water development and is now massively adopted by farmers in several African countries. We produce with farmers a very simple Eland Valley development plan and implement it. And we could see here around the farmer's field, the drainage canal, and how water is flowing in the drainage canal. We could see here the irrigation canal. The importance of the drainage canal is that it helps farmers to drain the fields when the water level is too high. And the importance of the irrigation canal is that it helps the farmer to irrigate the field when the rice plant needs water. Without these infrastructures, the whole valley will be flooded by now. Since 2018, when farmers started using the Smart Valley's approach, the yield and income more than doubled for three reasons mainly. First, farmers are no more vulnerable to droughts and floods, and then they are more resilient to climate change. Second, when farmers apply fertilizer in the fields, it benefits to the right plants, and the yield is good. Lastly, farmers invest more in agricultural production, and this actually contributes to increase the income. Monsieur, Monsieur Koulibaly Isaka, les producteurs gagnent plus de gains. And all the farmers are now happy, including me. Some were able actually to purchase motorbikes. Others were able to build a house. Now they are taking better care of their family. They can go to hospital when they are sick. We could see here the rice plants. This is Aurelius rice variety. Green. It's growing very well because it has enough water to grow. It has enough nutrients to grow. And this is actually the essence of the Smart Valley approach. Now we are producing vegetable and legume during the dry season. We can eat vegetable and legume and improve our nutrition. We can sell them to have money and start rice production with a small investment in terms of tillage, fertilizer application, and this really contributed to improve our conditions. Now with the Smart Valley approach, we are earning money. The Smart Valley approach is applied on the whole landscape using farmers' knowledge and only local materials. This is what makes the Smart Valley approach a sustainable approach. And we can see here how it contributes to improve the yield, how it contributes actually to preserve the soil, how it contributes to preserve the ecosystem services. Uh, the Smart Valley approach is quite a very simple approach and key message is that farmers are the 
key elements, the key agent points for the implementation of the approach. Ah.